Hey there, sheepdoggers, and welcome to Dead by Daylight, playing as a survivor today. And I'm just going to take you through my loadout, and then I'll go, so, you know, I'll take you through my loadout very quickly so you know what I'm rocking, uh, and what we're going to be doing, and then we'll go, and I'll go and find a match, and then I'll start the recording again after i found a match. So, running with a first aid kit, 16 charges, we've got the rubber gloves, slightly decreases the healing skill check difficulty, uh, bandages add 8 charges, and then we have the Fragrant Primrose Blossom, uh, grants 75% bonus in the Altruism category. The Altruism category, of course, being helping people. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be trying to help people, heal them, and etc. We won't be doing as much uh, repairing and everything. I want to keep my team alive. And then we have Hope, the growing odds of a successful escape. Fully with Hope and give you wings. Your movement speed is increased by 3% as soon as the exit gates are powered. Uh, which just basically means, you know, we should be, uh, we, we, sh we should be able to, you know, deal with anything along, you know, the lines of escape and helping other people while we're escaping, etc. Uh, so yeah, that's the, that's the basic plan, guys. So, uh, we will get going momentarily and I'll be back after, um, after I've managed to find a match for us. All right, so that literally took us about five seconds. Um, whoops, I knocked something over. Did not mean to do that. Uh, yeah, so that, that that gave that took us like literally five seconds. Uh, so maybe the matchmaking is a lot better now. Um, it was never terrible. There was just a bit of there was a lot of like failing to connect and you know all that kind of stuff. So uh, hopefully, hopefully. Okay, so we're at Coldwind Farm, which we know fairly well. Um, and let's see if we can find some friends. That is not good. That is not good, my friends. Where is he? Okay. Ooh. I heard him chug his uh, chainsaw. Okay, so we could work on. Shit. He's going right for this one, I think. Ooh. Oh! Oh! Oh, oh, sweet baby Moses. I think we work on this for now. Now that he's come here and left, uh, I think we work on this. And apparently it was a good idea to hide right by this because, uh, yeah, it, did, it worked out pretty, pretty fine. Pretty well, pretty well damn diddly good. Okay, come on. Easy. Easy. Okay, so you do get an audio clue when there's a skill check. It'll go like bum. There. So you just gotta listen out for those audio clues. There. Okay. Go, that's one done. Hey there, buddy. How you doing? Okay, so that's one done. That's really good. I think he's over that way. I think I just saw his red, like, torch flash over there, so. Don't know what that other one, that other person's doing. Sounds like someone's getting this going. Sounds like someone's getting this one going over here. They're almost done. You don't need my help, I might just mess it up. Just 
fight down here. So we've got two left to go already, and I've done nothing in altruism. This may not have been that. This may have been an obvious place to hide. Honestly, I should move out a little bit. Okay. Where is he? There he is. Has he seen me? No, it doesn't look like he's seen me. Okay. All right. Now, I don't want to be too bold, because it looks like a lot of the other guys don't have anything with them. Uh, so me having the, the first aid kit is fairly important. The other two seem to be not carrying anything with them. Okay, there you are. Hey, how are you doing? Yeah, reunited. No, not reunited. Okay, where are you going? I mean, she seems fine, so... I'm not going to worry about her too much. Now, what I'm going to do... So, listen for the audio clue. Um, yeah. So, uh, never run over those things. If if the killer doesn't know where you are, never run over those things. Uh, it's just not a good idea. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to work on this. And I'm going to repair it up. Not sure where that guy went, um, Marvin. It'd be nice if I had a perk that showed me where people were. Oh, lagging, lagging. Please don't tell me the dude's left. I think we had a survivor go this way, but I don't know exactly where they went, so. Two people. <clears throat> Two people being all uh, injured and shit. I'd love to get some healing done. Just need to find them. And open this, but I'm not leaving. over there.
Let's go. Let's go. Okay, I'm not gonna heal. Everyone's everyone's free. They've got their chance. Fucking poop. Ah, god damn it. Can I save him again? I'm gonna have to. Wait. 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 Is he dead? Yeah, he's dead. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna leave. There's no way I could save him the second time. God damn it. I should have healed him, maybe, but they're just, you know. I did my best. Right there. Whew, okay. <clears throat> so we didn't get much chance to for altruism, unfortunately, in that one. It was a very quick uh, way to go. Uh, but we did manage to do some quite useful things, uh, which got us a lot of uh, blood points. Uh, so Marvin uh, had had uh, Iron Will, uh, able to concentrate, enter, so grants of pain caused by injuries are reduced while staying still. Uh, Dark Sense, uh, when the exit gates are powered, killer's aura is revealed to you for seven seconds, and Saboteur unlocks the ability to sabotage without a toolkit. Oh, that is useful. That's very cool. Damn, Marvin, dude. Okay, uh, so, yeah. So there you go, you can see we have uh, 21,000 because uh, we had a, uh, oh, there it is, we had uh, this ritual here, successfully opened two, two exits with Dwight, uh, so we managed to get that done. We've also got heal other survivors for equivalent of nine health states, we've got three, we're doing alright with that, we got rescue four survivors from the hook with Meg Thomas as well, which, you know, you get some decent amount of, uh, of stuff with that, uh, which one's Meg? That's Claudette. There's Meg. Okay, so we have to rescue people with Meg. Um, how are we doing here? I think... Okay, we haven't actually... Uh, three... Yeah, mm, mm. Let's have a look at our loadouts. Okay, so... What we're doing at the moment is we're leveling up the Wraith. Level 5. <coughs> Reduces the Bell's disappearance time. Uh, bone Clapper. We've got Predator. Acute Tracking. Footsteps marks stay visible one second longer than usual. That's actually really good. I'd say not the most useful with the Wraith. Uh, because of his invisibility perk. But definitely with the other two, that would be a great one to have. Okay, so I think what we do, seeing as we did such a good job with Dwight, <coughs> we'll leave some blood points about maybe. Uh, let's see what we got here. We've got 25% uh, bonus in objective. Yeah, we want that because we get a lot of objective points. Uh, it slightly increases luck. Okay. Let's open the mystery box. We got a, a battery, which I'm pretty sure is for the torch. Uh, we got some more rubber gloves, of course. Jolly good. Uh, got another flashlight we can grab and also retardant jelly. Uh, moderately slows down the burning rate of the map. Ooh. So I'm fairly sure I know how the uh, how the map works, but yeah. Okay, so we'll leave it like that. And is there anything we can just take on? Let's. I do like the trapper as well. Like the hillbilly is my least favorite uh, so far. Yeah, we could take something, couldn't we? Uh, what is his perk? The iron grasp. I actually really quite like. It sounds good. I know, bud. I know. Uh, let, let's get these serrated jaws. Um, at the moment, uh, yeah, 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 that, that's that's fine. Uh, and then we we do actually have the iron grasp perk already, uh, which is interesting. But yeah, what are you gonna do? Uh, okay, cool, cool. So uh, there you go, guys. That is um. That that is uh, Dead by Daylight, a survivor thing. Now. What I'd like you guys to do is just tell me in the in the comments, you know, 
what exactly is it you're wanting to see? Are you wanting to see like a couple of rounds? Are you want to see? Are you wanting to see like play with friends? Are you happy? You know, just seeing me play the solo stuff. You know, what what would you like to see more of in regards of Dead to Day Dead by Daylight? Because I do really enjoy it, and I I want to give you guys more. I just want to make sure you know it's worth it for all of us to keep keep going with. So, uh, chuck a comment down in, in in the in the comment section. Let me know. Uh, so, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Always helps me out a lot. I do really appreciate it, and I will see you in the next one.